In the heart of South Texas, a remarkable engineering feat has finally reached its long-awaited conclusion, one that redefines the skyline of Corpus Christi and sets a new benchmark in American infrastructure. The newly completed Harbor Bridge, now the tallest structure in South Texas and home to the longest concrete cable-stayed span in the U.S., isn't just another transportation project. It's a bold symbol of innovation, resilience, and vision for the future why a new bridge was needed. The original Harbor Bridge, constructed in 1959, was once hailed as a marvel of mid-20th century engineering. Designed as a steel through arch bridge, it provided a vital link between Corpus Christi and its bustling seaport, supporting both commuter traffic and the movement of goods for more than 60 years. However, as traffic volumes surged and the shipping industry evolved, the bridge's limitations became increasingly evident. Its narrow lanes, absence of shoulders, and outdated safety features made it less suitable for modern vehicular traffic. Perhaps most critical was its vertical clearance of just 138 feet, which significantly restricted access for larger next-generation cargo vessels, a growing concern for a port aiming to stay globally competitive. Recognizing these challenges, the Texas Department of Transportation, TxDOT, initiated a feasibility study in 2003. By 2008, the verdict was cleared. The aging bridge was no longer adequate. Replacing it wasn't just an option. It was a necessity to safeguard the region's economic future. A vision of elegance and strength. From its inception, the new bridge was envisioned as more than a functional piece of infrastructure. It would be a defining civic landmark, seamlessly combining architectural beauty with structural brilliance. The selected design, a concrete segmental cable-stayed bridge, stands as a testament to modern engineering. At the center of this colossal structure is a 1,661-foot main span, making it the longest concrete cable-stayed span in the country. Flanked by soaring pylons that rise 538 feet above the Bay. The bridge dominates the skyline, visible for miles and glowing at night thanks to a sophisticated LED lighting system that adds both charm and visibility. The bridge boasts six wide lanes, three in each direction, complete with generous shoulders and a central barrier to enhance safety. Pedestrians and cyclists haven't been left out. A shared use path accompanied by public plazas on either end ensures the bridge is accessible and welcoming to all. But the transformation extends far beyond the bridge itself. Over six miles of adjacent highways were also upgraded, including portions of US-181, Interstate 37, and State Highway 286, improving connectivity and setting the stage for smoother regional traffic flow. A Maritime Game Changer Among the most transformative aspects of the New Harbor Bridge is its impressive 205-foot vertical clearance, a stark contrast to the previous structure's 138-foot limit. This dramatic elevation not only improves navigation, but unlocks a new era for the port of Corpus Christi, which can now receive post-Panamax vessels, enormous cargo ships that were once too large to access the bay. This upgrade goes far beyond aesthetics or statistics. It amplifies the port's operational capacity, enabling the movement of significantly more freight and placing Corpus Christi firmly among the top-tier U.S. ports by cargo volume. In a world where maritime trade continues to evolve rapidly, the bridge serves as a vital catalyst for regional growth, logistical agility, and global competitiveness. It's not just a piece of infrastructure, it's an economic engine built over water. A rocky road to completion. The journey to bring the new Harbor Bridge to life began with optimism and high expectations. In August 2016, construction was officially launched with a budget of $930 million and an ambitious goal of opening by 2020. The contract was awarded to Flatiron Dragados, a joint venture known for its experience in large-scale infrastructure projects. Their involvement inspired confidence and energized both the public and the city's leadership. Initial progress was promising. Foundational elements and approach spans took shape efficiently, and the project's early pace suggested that completion was well within reach. Local businesses looked forward to increased traffic and customer flow, while port authorities anticipated the economic windfall of accommodating larger cargo vessels. For many in Corpus Christi, the bridge was more than a construction site. It was a powerful symbol of the city's evolution and ambitions. But as the months rolled on, the project encountered a series of unanticipated obstacles. What started as a smooth, confident build soon gave way to delays, design concerns, and engineering controversies that would challenge timelines, budgets, and public trust. The path to completion would ultimately prove to be as monumental as the bridge itself. Engineering turmoil and setbacks. 
trouble began in March 2018 when a pedestrian bridge designed by the same engineering firm, FIG Bridge Engineers, collapsed at Florida International University, tragically killing six people. Although the structural designs were different, the incident sent shockwaves through the industry and cast doubt on FIG's overall safety practices. By 2019, concerns about the new harbor bridge's design led to an independent review. The results were alarming. Several structural deficiencies were flagged, leading to a halt in construction on the main span. A figure was ultimately removed from the project, forcing a complete redesign of crucial elements. As if that weren't enough, additional concerns arose in 2021 regarding the Delta frame a vital structural component of the cable stayed system. Once again, work paused while engineers re-evaluated and updated designs, further delaying the project. Costs ballooned to nearly $1.2 billion and public confidence waned. What was once a symbol of progress became synonymous with red tape and delay. Regaining momentum, a resilient comeback. The tide turned in 2022 when newly appointed engineering teams, working closely with the developers and TexDOT, finalized updated safety certified designs. With new quality control measures and enhanced safety protocols, construction resumed with a renewed sense of urgency and accountability. By late 2023, the towering pylons were visibly taking shape over the bay, finally restoring faith in the project's future. In early 2025, the main span was completed, a pivotal moment that marked the transition from prolonged delay to near completion. By mid-2025, all major construction, including interchanges and approach roadways, had wrapped up. In June, traffic officially began crossing the new bridge, and a ribbon-cutting ceremony celebrated not just the physical structure, but the determination of a community that refused to give up on it, engineered for the ages. This isn't just a bridge for today, it's a bridge for the next century and beyond. With an estimated lifespan of 170 years, the new Harbor Bridge is a masterclass in long-term engineering resilience. Built to withstand hurricane force winds, seismic activity, and storm surges, the bridge's elevated profile and reinforced materials provide critical protection in a climate-sensitive region. Its streamlined cable-stayed design also minimizes the number of in-water supports, reducing impact on marine life and improving navigation for ships. This future-oriented mindset extends to maintenance planning, with modern monitoring systems embedded throughout the bridge to ensure its long-term structural health. A beacon for South Texas, what lies ahead? With the southbound lanes open and northbound lanes set to debut shortly after July 4th, 2025, the Harbor Bridge is now fully operational. Meanwhile, demolition crews have begun dismantling the old structure, a moment of nostalgia for many longtime residents, but also a poignant reminder of just how far the city has come. As the bridge settles into daily use, it is already reshaping life in Corpus Christi and the broader region. The city's transportation network has become faster, safer, and more efficient. The port is poised for expanded trade and the skyline has gained a striking new focal point. In the coming years, the bridge will carry millions of vehicles, bear witness to countless sunrises over the bay, and stand as a testament to a community's endurance, vision, and hope for the future. And that wraps up our deep dive into the incredible journey of the New Harbor Bridge. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and ring the bell icon so you never miss an update. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one. Thank you